Hello, welcome to this video. We have done so much stuff since last time and it's really starting to come together, which is really exciting. And I guess that you maybe can see it as well, because yes. now it's starting to look like a home. We are Tobias and Ida, and we have just bought ourselves a van that we are converting into the ultimate adventure camper van. Since we live in Norway and it's in the middle of the winter, we have rented parts of a barn where we can do our build. And the first thing we need to discuss or talk about is the floor. It's the floor. The floor is done, done and done. So now we have the rubber, rubber, uh, rubber plastic floor-ish in the garage, in the back of the van. Mm -hmm. And then we have this beautiful floor. Living room kitchen area. It's a laminate floor. We have chosen to go with an uh, IKEA floor. It's called Prairie. It means prairie in English. And it's, uh, it's like a dark uh, wood color thing. The floor was a little bit tricky because, uh, as you know, um, the van is straight, straight oh. at all, and there's angles everywhere. So they had to do some some um, cutting, and some cutting, and some some fixing. Uh, I'm trying to figure out what which side is going to the wall. Do you conclude anything? Um, I think it's this side. Um. I think. So it's a bit tricky here in the start, but hopefully it will get easier as we go. So I'll cut this edge over here, and now I have to cut this one, and then I also have to find this arch here to make it fit. So nothing is easy in the van. Perfect. Did you tell them about their little Machine. Yeah, so this is a small hack that Tobias made. Just a piece of ply. Drill the hole. <laughs> and then you squeeze your pen through. And then you can use it to figure out the exact... Um, angle. Angle. Is that an angle, is it? Arch. Arch, yeah, the exact arch that you want based on the, the wall. So you just slide it. Woo! And then you find it. So let's just hope it works. First, you can try. <gasps> Not really. So then we need a little bit on this side. Nice. Yes! They have the angle more or less, don't you? Yeah, I think this is good. Should I place some small pieces over there? Yeah. Well, if you can give me some pieces before you start. Give me some pesos. Give me some pesos. There's really not that much pesos going around anymore. We have fitted the two first pieces of floor. Pieces of floor. <laughs> the two first pieces of the floor. So now we have calculated that we need seven more. Fit. Voila. Yay. I think we got ourselves a new floor. Yay! Next step is to add this nice metal edge. And with that, I think uh, more or less all flooring and all edges is done. So that's huge. Do you guys think it fits? I think it is because I know we tested it before it's already gone. But anyway, <laughs> let's try it out. Oh. Incredible! Incredible! <laughs> Super nice! Look at that! Nice, nice, nice! Yeah, so let's screw it! And it's done! 
We're really happy with the color and the look. Adds a lot of nice texture and color to the yes. to that. Super happy about it. So we, as you can see, we have covered up the bracket holes. Yeah. Because we haven't uh, found a seat that we could have yet and so on. So we decided to just go for it. To move, to move on in the process. Yeah. yeah. But the, the holes are still there so we could uh, always open it up and install the seats later. <laughs> And then we have the whole ceiling thing. Yes. Uh, the first thing we did was the, the... I don't know what you call it. The, plastic, oh yeah, the, the, the frame? No, it's not the frame. It's a cover plate for the fans. Yeah. And it's white plastic, so a lot of people kind of adding it in mm -hmm. last. But we decided, we decided to do it actually first. So what we have done is that we have uh, made a indent in the framing for the fan. So you could shove this up. So it's totally snug, so then we could build the wall or the ceiling so you don't see so much of this big ugly plastic thing. Or underneath the, the black ply here, mm -hmm. so that's what's the first thing we do. So um, the, yeah, the reason why we want it like that is because our ceiling is going to be dark brown. So we really don't want that white plastic around because yeah. it's going to break too much with the rest of the ceiling. So on top of this uh, black paint the ply we are going to have some uh, painted brown painted um, cladding so that could be really nice and before we could actually add the, the ply we had to do all this wiring so the all the wires for the for the down lights and the fans and so on is actually done so it's up, Yay! up in the ceiling so that's nice all right our electrical can do it is working and we're now running uh, or pulling the cables for the down lights so uh, we're gonna tape this to this one because it's a bit thicker than this is made for. So let's hope it works. And the wiring was a little bit more tedious than we'd imagined. Because as you know, we had prepped the conduit before. So we actually just had to like pull the wires. Um, so apparently some of the conduit just kind of travels around the car like for meters and meters. We hadn't really thought about that length is an issue. As, uh, as of the current no. as well. So we have to dimension the, the wires uh, in that in mind. So, but mo for most of it, we could actually use the conduit, conduit that we yeah. have done. But for some parts, we actually had to, to, to do some new reroting and uh, so yeah. on. We have finished with the wiring in the ceiling for the down lights. So our next step is to actually put up the first part of the ceiling before we do the cladding. We had painted it from before, so it was already painted. My mom came here and painted it for us. Super nice. Thank you for that. Yes. Thank you very much. So we just had to fit it into place, which was easier said than done. Definitely. And as you can see, it's a lot of holes for all the down lights. And we have two holes for the fans. And again, nothing is straight, nothing is in uh, the 90 degrees angles. So it was a bit of a trick to, to find uh, the right spot for everything. But I'm really impressed and very happy that it turned out as it did. And all these, uh, or both of these fan holes yeah. are actually perfect. And <laughs> very modest, they're perfect. They are very perfect. humble, they are perfect. Yes. yes. So happy with that. Yeah, really happy about it. So a very nice uh, week of work. Yes, we've come a long way, I think, because, yeah. So it look, started looking very nice, and the next step now is actually to, to add the kitchen Yay. and add back the bed. So, I think yeah. with a kitchen and a bed... We are ready to rumble. We are ready to rumble. Mm -hmm. So, this van is going for a tour. Yes. And we are bringing you with us. So with that, thank oh. you so much for this video. Yes. Do you want to I just said, hopefully you want to join us on our trip. So that's what I was saying. <laughs> well, we hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to follow our journey, then subscribe to our channel. We would really appreciate it. Just bye bye. See you soon. Bye bye.